absolute rarity from the Tsumeb mine in Namibia, sitting on a pretty solid Galena matrix. Now, I think this is the matrix where you'd find some of the rare earth minerals, maybe some uh, pyrite uh, associated too, and things like granierite quite possibly. We have this bladed formation of smithsonite, which has a... Um, a brown color, brown to red color, which would be inclusions of iron oxides most likely in the smithsonite. I know that the, the green smithsonite we call um, cuprone and smithsonite and the, the yellow one or the one with the yellow core would be the cadmium smithsonite. I don't know if there's a name for this particular color. Of course, all the way from the Tsumeb in Namibia, um, Almost half a hand size, quite a heavy, relative weight is quite heavy, a little bit of uh, appears like calcite crystals sitting on top there. From a display point of view, sitting on a lovely base, across like that, there you can see some of the galena crystallization, cubic, cubic formation, across like that. And then of course from the, the top down, the, the section which we want to see is this section. It's quite, quite lovely. Let me see how close we can get in there. There you can see the, the, the Smithsonite, um, almost the bladed formation of Smithsonite sitting on the Galena. Came out of a certain pocket. Uh, of course, Sumep Mine, historical deposit no longer being mined, now it's 2021. Um, and uh, uh, very well known internationally for the abundance of, of uh, so many mineral species which occurred there. Guys, of course, were mining for copper and lead only.